the individual. Maybe that's a good model. And that's how prepaid legal was born. Does that make sense? We yeah. fast forward to today, my service. My service will be five years July the 1st. So I've been able to serve this company for five years. My contribution is very simple. I grew up in an age where technology was constantly progressing. When I was born, they didn't have mobile phones, right? I remember the first mobile phone, it was basically in a bag, and it had a wire attached to the, the receiver, right? I mean, but I mean, as it continued, I've grown up with technology. When I joined Ford Motor Company, Wang Computers dominated yeah. the world. Anybody heard of a Wang Computer? Yeah. 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 Then you're, you, you, you're going to get some points on a trivia contest. It doesn't exist anymore. Okay. Green screens. You know, I love uh, the space movies, you know, where it's like, you know, our mother, are we going to make it? In the movie Alien, you know, it's got this green screen, you know, it, probably not, you know, it's like, <laughs> my God, they're able to take this giant ship and put it out in space, you know, but they don't have much of a computer. You see how far we've come. Right? What I've done, what we've done, is simply now empowered a fantastic idea, a fantastic network of lawyers with a mobile app. So let's explore what does it do. Well, first I want to make sure that you understand that we are mission-based. When we talk about a noble cause, I want you to understand that what unites us all. First off, may I just point out that as we look around this room, wouldn't it be wonderful if rooms like this existed everywhere in the United States of America and Canada? Okay, this kind of diversity? Uh, isn't this the kind of country that you want to see? Where everybody loves everybody, and everybody is equal? Does that, does that make sense? Well, I'll tell you something. That's what motivates us. Our diversity is, in fact, our unity. Because red or yellow, black or white, young or old, rich or poor, we come together with one simple vision. We wish to provide equal access to liberty, to equality, to opportunity, and to justice. The kind that every human being deserves. Does that make sense to everyone? That's what motivates us. And by the way, it's a vision. It's always out of reach, but it's never out of sight. That's what makes a vision. That's what motivates us every single day. Okay, so this is a simple way to think about this. Have you ever signed an agreement, like a lease, without having a lawyer look at it? I did, the first time I got an apartment, right? Regretted it. By the way, I didn't get my security deposit back, okay? You know, again, perfect example. You know, have you ever had a landlord tenant issue? I have, right? Landlords always muscle their tenants, always. Unless you're a Legal Shield member. You want to do something about that, then you help protect and empower more people with Legal Shield. And then they can stand up to the man. By the way, the best way to tell a landlord what's going on is have the lease reviewed by your law firm before you sign it and have them communicate with the lease. Yeah. Now the landlord says, by the demonstration, I have a tenant who has a law firm. Okay? Note to sell. Give back the security deposit. You think I'm joking? I'm not joking. I'm not joking. I'm not joking. Look, as I've said, have you ever been overcharged? I have. Right? I mean, my wife and I have been married 32 years. 33 this man. We haven't done a lot of home repairs. We just did one last year. And it was a disaster. It was not like the home network, home house and gardens TV or whatever it is. It was not like flip it or flop it or whatever it's called. I'm just telling you, man. I mean, where are all the nice people? You know, this day it took us seven months to do a bathroom. And, and, and every they flooded the basement twice. You know, I'm like, is this the Keystone Cops? What is going on? You know, and they're like, well, you know, and we'd like to have a 20% profit markup and an overhead of 15 more. I mean, like, you know, dude, what are you smoking? I mean, I'm not paying you guys for money for this. You are, you are ruining my house. Help to have legal shield. Help to have legal shield. One letter. Okay, one letter. It was like, you know, we're here. Still making mistakes, but at least you're not being overcharged right. for the work. Does that make sense? Yeah. It just levels the playing field. I mentioned it. I've got HRF disease. Heavy right foot. <laughs> anybody else? <laughs> hey, anybody take notes? 42 million speeding tickets in the United States of America last year. Write that number down. 42 million. Why aren't they all members of Legal Shield? By the way, the answer is pulled up. If you got a compact lace, pulled up the mirror right now. Okay? You're the reason we don't have 42 million members. <laughs> They're all getting speeding tickets. Wow. Just talk to people. Hey, when's the last time you got a speeding ticket? Oh, last week. Why? Well, I got something for you. Okay? Sounds like you can eat it. All right? Because, you know. By 
By the way, not 42 million unique people. I will say that also, right? I mean, some people are serial speakers. <laughs> that, 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 I'm, I'm just saying. I'm just saying, right? Different strokes for different folks. Less than half the people in the United States and Canada have a will. And that's a problem. I mean, that's a problem. When we talk about estate planning, which is included in this membership, you also should know that if you have a child that is in college right now, I don't want to scare you, but if they get sick or in an accident, you don't have any control over their medical treatment unless you have a durable power of attorney for healthcare matters. So please put that on your list if you haven't done it. And everyone you talk to that you know has children in college, it's a reason to become a legal shield member today. And then get that will and that durable power of attorney for healthcare and financial matters handled. We all have aging parents. You need to have something done for them, and then you also need to start to plan with that durable power for healthcare and financial matters for you to be able to do things for them if they lose the capacity to do it themselves. You do not want to hassle the state over the death of a loved one without a will. You do not want to have to hassle a hospital if somebody has lost the capacity to care for themselves, if they're in a coma or they're incapacitated. These are serious issues. And again, you think, well, it's a nice to have. My friends, you are not living free if you do not have a will. I mean, it's just that simple. You literally are giving up your rights. They're your rights. You have a right to this. This is how the law works. You need to have that document. That's how you were able to exert your right and live free. Everyone should have a will. Real estate transactions. I mentioned the lease, it's also for a home. Mortgages can be complicated. And this has two parts. One you think of, well, I know what the price is. Sometimes with the lender, it's better to have your law firm look at it and make sure that there's nothing funny in there. The other one we don't put up, it just happened for me. I thought, you know what? I'm gonna send this lease agreement from Volkswagen Audi in just for a quick look-see. We were about to take a lease on a facade. I said, you know, I have never done it before. Got a call. Yeah, there's some problems here, right? There are some charges here that are not required, and not only are they putting them into this, they're then going to make you pay finance on top of the charges. Wow. Do you understand? And, you know, I thought I paid attention. Part, part of it, I worked in automotive for so long, quite frankly, I'm just like, can we just hurry up? You know, I mean, you know, but it was stupid, right? I was in a hurry, and I was going to start paying. The law firm protected me. And again, very casual, just sent the, the lease agreement in. Yeah, this isn't right, okay? By the way, there's no disclosure here on the lemon laws in the state of Washington. Those kinds of things. Does that make sense? Yeah. All right. The other one I want to talk about today is data breach. It's not a question of whether your information has been compromised, whether by our own federal government, who does want to serve and love us, but they gave up a lot of information on all of us, or it's, uh, you know, Target or Sony or Yahoo. You know, I mean, the, it's out there. The issue is, are you willing to run the risk, like literally play roulette with your own life and wait for the letter that says something bad has happened and now you're guilty until you can prove your innocence? When a letter comes to your home and says you're past due on a boat loan and you don't have a boat, that's a bad day. <laughs> this happened, by the way. This happened to our member, right? But when you find out, when you get pulled over, because in this case, Maybe the tail lights out. True story. And then suddenly they run, and then they arrest you. One of our members, a woman, was arrested. What? Well, well, I, I, well, tail lights out. Yeah, but they're outstanding warrants for you in another state, assaulting a police officer. Okay. Literally cuffed. Went to the station. First call, legal shield. Second call, ID shield. It was in fact an identity theft where an individual had assumed this person's identity had leased an apartment during eviction, had assaulted the sheriff that had done the eviction process, went to jail, was released two days later, and had fled. Guess what? She was released within an hour after calling legal shield on her own recognizance without bail. Our private investigators completely exonerated that it was not her at all, it was an identity theft, and all of that was completely wiped from her record. That's the power of ID issue. Okay, so how does it work? Well, if anyone has Spotify or Netflix or has used Uber, or quite frankly, more and more, we do our banking, do we not? I remember when I first got an app on my phone from like Bank of America, 
You know, and it was like, you know, you can make a deposit with this. And I'm like, oh, that does not sound safe at all. Okay. I'm just telling you, I do not trust that at all. We all do now, right? We're moving money around. It's, you know, it's just like second nature to us. Well, in the same way, what I'm saying is now is the right time for people to believe that we put a law firm in the palm of your hand. You have to touch this button and you can speak to your law firm on any issue, unlimited. If you have a question, call and ask. It's better to find out you're wrong than to do something and find out afterwards. Trust me on that. Because we've all watched enough of the, of the law shows on television, we feel like we're lawyers, do we not? You know, like, I know what I'm doing, you know? I saw that on episode 72, you know? Uh, LA Law, you know? Make the call, unlimited. I mentioned speeding tickets. The thing that's cool about this is that you can use the camera to photograph the ticket when you receive it. You know, don't go into a place of shame, of embarrassment. Look, we're all guilty, let's be honest. Okay, so let's go ahead and just own it for a second. Photograph the ticket, share it with one person, your lawyer. It's confidential, okay? You don't have to tell your partner if you don't want to, all right? That's up to you, all right? But photograph the thing, look what date it is, put it down, they will help you. We don't have a guarantee like get out of jail free, okay? But I will tell you this, Warren Buffett doesn't have any points on his license. I wonder why, right? Because he's got a lawyer, right? You see what I'm saying? You just need to be treated equally. Yeah. We're not changing the laws, right? That's not our job, right? That's what the legislature does. That's what the citizens have to do on their own. But the laws that exist have to be equal for everyone. Thank you. I mentioned before the will. There are so many things in life. Look, folks, here's one for you. In life, law happens, right? It's not about being law abiding. Honest to God, in life, law happens. The things you do in life, law happens, right? You need to have a will. You, quite frankly, before you get married, it, it's appropriate and mature. More millennials are having prenuptial agreements drawn up than any other generation. Why? Because they're waiting later to get married, and they're just talking about it honestly, right? Hey, we love each other right now, right? But what happens if you I'm just saying, right? Let's just clarify right now. I hate to say this, but it's, it's something you should probably not really believe in. In a way, a prenuptial is a little bit like doing a, a, a will, right? I mean, you know, you got to get ahead, right? You got to think it through, right? I mean, you can lay that all out. Guess who didn't have a prenup? Jeff and Mackenzie Bezos. I'm just saying, all right? You know, and you could say, well, she got $35 million. I don't know. I mean, she got 25%. Oh, man. Okay? She was a partner for that entire life. She has no voting rights on those shares. I mean, you know, again, I'm just saying. Now, you can say $35 billion, but I'm just saying, you know? Better to have the conversation up front. Okay. By the way, divorce is another one that's tough. But, and again, most people think, like, you know, I don't have the money to, uh, to get a lawyer for a divorce. You know, people just kind of like, people walk away from each other, right? But there are issues with, with custody, with child care. It's better to go ahead and now privately begin the discussion. All of those forms on the app are meant to begin a conversation with your lawyer, confidential. Bankruptcy too, it sounds crazy. The reason we have a nation that grows in its economy is that people take risks and sometimes they fail. But rather than put them in, you know, what was it, it used to be called um, debtor's jail. That was what the English did. They put you in jail because, you know, you're bankrupted and now you have to be in jail. We don't do that. We go through the bankruptcy proceedings so you can start your life again. It's actually one of the great, it sounds weird, but one of the great strengths of our economy is that we let people take risks, fail, and start again. Most nations don't have a bankruptcy code like we do, where you can go through it in an orderly manner and get out on the other side. Rather than have a stigma associated with it, we provide to all of our members the ability to fill out that form and have a conversation with the law firms. Does that make sense? Yeah. Again, less shame, less fear, more empowerment, more confidence. The other thing is, and this is where the name Legal Shield came from, 24-7, 365. If you ever feel that your rights, your freedoms, your liberties, are being denied or threatened, that is a tremendously powerful statement. If you feel like your rights, liberties, and freedoms are being threatened, you have the right to speak to an attorney. I mean, when I first arrived five years ago, I didn't even know what it was like. 
Hey, we're there for you 24-7. But then it was like, you know, but when, you know, on a Tuesday, if it's a full moon or whatever. No, this is the state. If you feel threatened, if you're in the presence of law enforcement and you feel like you're going to be incarcerated for whatever reason, push the red button. Okay? It doesn't matter guilt or innocence. You have the right to representation immediately. Immediately. Does that make sense? Yeah. If anyone's ever trying to take your children, you've got to have representation. Yeah. And the other thing we don't always think about is again, sometimes people are all excited about getting you to sign something. You know, oh, you slipped on my uh, my sidewalk and you know hurt your back. You know, here would you sign this? Sometimes I tell you, in hospitals, people are like, well, you know, you have you have a, an estate plan. You have a, a power of, a, of, a, of attorney for uh, health care. Well, here, sign this one that we did with the hospital. Guess what that document says? We're not guilty of doing anything wrong. Whenever people try and get you to sign things, okay, that's when you need to push the red button. When you feel like, I got no, where do I turn? We are the answer. Okay, I swear that's the best way to think about it. When you've got a problem, we are the answer. We're there when you're alone. Okay. Oh, one of the other things I would Yeah. Is everything covered? Yes, it is. Some things are covered by the monthly fee. Other things are covered by a discount hourly rate. You may say, oh, wait a minute, now it's trickery. No, it's not. <laughs> what if you were a guest here today and you're like, I just got in an automobile accident last week. Is that covered? Yes, it is. You're going to have a law firm that is going to be able to speak to you and help you, and you're not going to have to go through the phone book and find somebody and pay the average rate. You're going to get a discount off of that rate. You say, well, how much? Legalshow.com, Georgia, Debbie Parker, look at the situation, automobile, it will tell you what the rate is. And then if you want to, Google, average rate for lawyers in Georgia. It's less than that, okay? It's always at least 25% off, and many times it's much less. I had a woman come up to me, another pre-existing condition is what I'm talking about. She said, hey, I, I'm in a divorce. My, my ex, soon to be ex, is really putting me through a lot of uh, difficulties. I have children, I've got, are you, I'm paying $375 an hour. That is more. Are you telling me that I can join Legal Shield, get a lawyer, pay less than that, and get this divorce handled? I said, yes, ma'am, that is what I'm saying to you. In fact, you know, I'd like for you to meet the lawyers here from DSK, happen to have been at that particular event. She wrote me a letter. She said, not only did I save $150 an hour, it was finished in two weeks. Today, I'm just telling you, it's everything you know is wrong. See, the old model for law is they're always wanting to spend more time. Why? They get paid by the hour. Right. We do not have law firms that are paid by the hour. They're paid by the member. Mm -hmm. Their productivity is the focus of what they do. They're not incentivized in any way, shape, or form to take more time than they need to take. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah. All right, great. Okay, the other one is, by the way, personal injury. I, all, I added this slide myself because a woman came up to me and said, I've been a member, and I just love it so much, and it gave me the confidence to then, when I was hurt, you know, to go and find a lawyer that would represent me in my injury. I'm like, I'm sorry, what? Wow. She's like, yes, you know, I felt confident now that I had legal shield that I was able to do that. I'm like, well, why didn't you use the law firm with legal shield? She's like, you can do that? So I'm telling you today, you can do that, okay? Because this is your law firm. But I want to really stress this. This is a relationship. This is not a transaction. Again, the other thing that we're always taught is law is a transaction. Well, I do something wrong, transaction. I need something right, transaction. This is a relationship. It's like having a great doctor. We all feel better if we have a doctor we can trust. Do we not? We also know that that doctor probably is not going to do brain surgery. Right? But we trust them because they will give us a referral to an expert. We have it even better than that. The law firm is a practice that has everybody. Tax, family, traffic, business, everything's there. Criminal, civil, does that make sense? So while you always have a relationship with the firm, you always give the representation that you need. All right, hey, who's coming? The member, the member's partner or spouse. Never married, children up to the age of 26, including full-time students, living at home. Dependent children under 18, for whom you're the legal guardian, and physically or mentally disabled children living at home for their entire life. Okay, for their entire life. Okay, here, here's, the, here's how we, we weed out the really smart people from, would you rather pay two fifty, three fifty an hour, or would you rather pay about a dollar a day to get this? It's less than a Starbucks coffee. It's quite frank.
Netflix, you know what I mean? It, it's, well, I just saw that Netflix went up to $15.99 a month. Okay? So it's moving. We are more than that. In all due respects, this is more important than watching videos. I'm not going to lie to you. Okay? I mean, I have Spotify. It's more important than listening to music, right? It's like, wow, you know, I'm gonna, I've got a really bad situation in my life. Let me listen to some music and feel better. <laughs> no, get the music. You know, get the music. Get the app on the phone. Get the app on the phone. All right. Identity theft. I've mentioned this. Look, you got to know your credit score. You got to know, right? The time you don't want to know your credit score is when you go to buy a car, lease a car, get a, an apartment, try and get a home. And then they're like, oh, the, you know, when they, when, they, when they get like the report, yeah, I just got a report bill. Oh. <laughs> Lots of places. Right? Right? You should know. It's on the phone, in the app, every day. It's updated every single month, whenever there's a change. And here's the key when anyone asks about your credit, you get an alert. Is this you? By the way, it's very affirming if, if, if you're buying a car. It's like, hey, you know, uh, GMC just, just pinged your credit. Was it you? Yes. That's also building the trust of what, of what it is we do. But if you put in other information, which we strongly, strongly, strongly encourage you to do. By the way, when you get a member to join as an associate, you should spend the time saying, look, let's really just walk through that you understand how to do this and see how easy it is. If you're ever waiting in a line, not while you're driving, by the way, in traffic, but when you're waiting in a line someplace, okay, you can enter information, right? And it's safe. So if you don't want to do it all at once, enter all the information at once, do it piecemeal, bit by bit. Put in your social security, put in your driver's license, put in your passport, put in a bank account, right? Does that make sense? And all that information is monitored and it's important. Including, by the way, your old emails and your present emails and with ID Shield Vault, putting in your passwords. One of the things that we just built is compromised credentials. So we're always now looking for the combination of your username and your password that you put into the ID Shield Vault to see if, in fact, they've been compromised. And then to alert you that you need to change your password. Hey guys, most of the people you'll talk to, all right, number one password in the United States is P-A-S-S-W-O-R-D. <laughs> and we all laugh, and yet, second most popular is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right? We need better passwords. We can tell them that. Social security password drivers like medical. Okay, people make false medical claims. They make false tax claims. They make uh, social security claims. This is how they may want your money, but most of these thieves want your identity to steal other people's money. And that's the problem. Then they contact you when they want their money back, and it wasn't you. You know, that's the scenario that you've got to protect yourself with. Same thing, by the way, with emergency access. You can call and replace lawyer with private investigators, certified. We have 12 certifications to be able to work with every government agency and entity, with every credit, as well as financial institution, to ensure that we do whatever it takes for as long as it takes to restore your identity to a pre-theft status. That's what our guarantee is. So, these two together, you know, again, it's just hand in glove. If you have an identity issue, you're probably going to be legal. If you have legal, you're smart enough to know that you should also protect your identity. Be monitored and have the ability for a licensed private investigator to protect you if things go wrong. And my friends, it's $49.90 a month for a family. Members, <laughs> partner, children, everybody is covered. An individual gets the legal plan, adds the individual ID to be monitored, it's $34.90. Again, I come back to it. I mean, Seattle has Starbucks, and, and, and I'll be honest, I mean, I find the coffee really expensive, right? And there are a lot of people buying it. You probably could build your business just by going to a Starbucks and just talking to the people coming out and asking them, hey, you got the legal ask? What? How much does that come to cost? Oh, I don't know, $2.95? <laughs> Let me talk to you about something that's going to change your life. You know what I'm saying? We'll talk about that in the training I do a little bit later. All right. Here's another one. Because we have over 4 million people that are protected by this program, 1.8 million households, 4.6 million people in North America, a lot of people would like to make offers to them to buy things. We call that member perks. It's not our core service. The only reason I bring this up is that people who use this, and again, you have to use it, they save more money than the membership costs. 
They save on their cable bills, on their mobile phone bills, on their insurance that they have for their home or for their automobile. If they go to movies or sporting events, if they purchase things, they're just discounts that are offered exclusively to us and they're incremental over any other discounts that are publicly available. So again, it's something that I like to bring up just because you can save your way to a free membership. Okay, so it's, it's a one way to overcome the, anyone's concern on the, the price of the membership. Now I hope everybody who's a guest here today does not have the membership. I hope very much you indeed get the membership. We can stop right now. My job is done. If you get the membership, my job is done because your life will be changed. But I also would like to spend a few moments if anyone would be interested in learning how to make money. But somebody like this. You see, we don't really sell, okay, we sell. All the things that I talked about today, in my own life, I'm just sharing stories. And most people say, yeah, you know, golly, I kind of, my life's like that too. You know, he's not saying anything that's not true. Uh, but, you know, that's happened to me. I mean, I, I'll be honest with you, I'm a, I'm a power user, okay, a legal shield, right? I am, and I don't even think that I'm particularly different than anybody else. It's just I'm life, right? I mean, it's just life. So we, by, by word of mouth, we just share our experiences. And people say, wow, you know, I see your belief. I see that, that this is something that matters to you. And when they become a member, people that become associates get paid. Very simple. It's word of mouth marketing, right? But, but one thing that also I will say is, by getting others to join you in sharing the word, you also get paid when they speak to people and get the membership going. That's called an override. It's based on the insurance model. Does there, anybody have insurance? Home insurance, renter's insurance, auto insurance? <laughs> Whoever you talk to, unless they own the agency, when they made a sale to you, someone above them is getting paid as well. Absolutely. The person that owns that agency. Does that make sense? So that's the whole concept of an override is, as you introduce others to be able to protect and empower more members, you also get rewarded for making that introduction and getting them started in the business. We don't, sometimes you'll hear the word recruiting. We like sponsor. This is a family, right? We like to sponsor people. We want people to get excited about the membership and then learn about this business, come to these meetings, <coughs> learn about this business, and succeed in this business, whether it's part-time or full-time. By the way, over 90% of our associates are part-time. Over 90%. And 42,000 people receive residual income, which I'll talk about in a minute. Okay, which is money that keeps coming in from the members that you protect. Okay, self-evident. Netflix doesn't pay you when you tell people that you like it. Okay, and Uber will give you some driving credits, but they ain't paying you full hard cash. Legal Shield pays you money. It's that simple. Become a member, use the membership, tell others about your experiences, and when they become a member, you get paid. That's as complicated as it is. Any questions? <laughs> you with me? Okay. So, first one, you can make the sale yourself. Second, Someone that you brought onto your team made a sale and you get paid as well. Third, residual commissions. As long as a member that you are protecting and empowering is using the membership, this is really critical. We want people to use the membership all the time. Okay? This is not like, hey, they signed up, you know, if something bad happens, remember you have it. Uh uh. Tap the app. Live life. Okay, when it down, shout it out. Tap the app. Use the membership. You with me? This is really important because the more people use the membership, the longer they stay. The longer they stay, the more you get paid. Every month they continue, you get the residual income. You get paid. We also like to work hard and play hard. I hope that's okay with everyone. We like to celebrate our hard work. We like to celebrate the family. Who's going to Cabo? Woo! Okay. We like to say, those that want to work harder, you can earn a trip that we pay for. Okay, it's pretty, it's pretty onerous what we ask you to do. We ask for you to get to the airport. <laughs> and then home from the airport after you've had a fantastic trip. Okay, that's your obligation. But other than that, it's covered, right? We go to Vegas or Orlando in the winter. We go to a beautiful uh, place like Cabo or to the Bahamas or to Jamaica. Okay, those are the kinds of places we go, two trips a year. 
And it's all based on, you decide, do I want to earn it? Because when you earn it, you're gone. Does that make sense? Yeah. And then bonuses, we'll do bonuses. We'll talk about that today. Okay, I want to talk now to the people that are brand new, potentially in this business, to our guests, or to brand new associates, right? I don't want to overwhelm them, but it's very simple. You get paid $60 when you become a member and then share your experiences with others and they become a member. You get paid $60. And, and by the way, I would strongly, strongly recommend if you're like, well, I don't have any reason to use it. Do you have a will? By the way, my mom has a will. I'm like, mom, what'd you do the will? 1993. I'm like, mom, I'm to do it again. <laughs> Let me tell you something, the difference between Legal Shield and everybody else. Even if somebody has a will, they think they're done. Uh -uh. At Legal Shield, you update your will every year. It doesn't cost any more. All right? You know that a will is $1,200, $1,200, $1,200, and Who would do it again? Nobody that's not a Legal Shield member. But with us, it's part of the membership. It's included in the fee. And, and you get updated every year. Okay, so here's one. Become a member and do your own will. Fill out the questionnaire. Talk to the law firm. Your belief will go through the roof. Why? You're like, I'm talking to a lawyer. And I'm not paying by the hour. And they're nice to me. And they're helping me. And I'm going to get a will done. And a durable power of attorney for healthcare and financial matters. And you're just like, oh my god. You know, I mean, whatever that crazy dude was saying on the Saturday recruiting event, all right, it's true, okay? I mean, I believe, I'm a believer. And then when you get somebody to join and you get paid $60, guess what the first thing you should do? Start them on the wheel. Slow down to speed up. Take the time, show that you care. Go through the mobile app, fill out, have them fill out the questionnaire, push the button, and they're gonna have a phone call. Make sure that they're having the phone call with the law firm. You see what I'm saying? You will build a business just on that activity alone. Now, if you sell $60 in premium, what did I say? $49.90 is one person both ways. We count that as 50, by the way. Everything rounds up. Everything rounds up, okay? You make one other sale. Could be the $9.95 individual ID shield plan. Could be another $24.95 just the legal shield plan, and you're over 60. Does that make sense? Yeah. So it's very simple in our business. Count the dollars. When, whenever you sell, we have small business plans, right? You can add a home business supplement if somebody's doing Airbnb and, and has a rental property or does an Etsy business on the side, Legal Shield and the home business supplement, now they have legal representation for their business. Collections, all kinds of issues, contracts, suppliers, all those kinds of things, right? Count the dollars. Make $60 in premium sale and find one person that wants to work with you Woo! and change their life. Okay? We call that 60 plus one. You get paid 60 each time you sell that membership. You sell $60 and get one, and you're gonna get a $200 bonus. Woo! And my friends, this is important. You can get paid fast, or you can get paid slow. It's up to you. By the way, you're always